Hey everyone, Screen913 here. Welcome back to Swator. Um, Eleanor is over in the cantina. She's been there for several hours. I, I'm gonna check my mail. I'm supposed to meet up with her. Alright, but I've got a lot of mail to get through, so let's get through it. We've got a mail from Moff Hurden. Uh, we've had a breakthrough, my lord. Since you captured General Ferrari, he has re resisted our questioning on the subject of Project Siantide. Last night, however, we broke the stubborn general. The secrets of Project Siantide now belong to the Empire. As you saw in Taurus, the military benefits are boundless. Siantide prototypes have begun development. Thanks to your efforts, the Republic will soon feel the sting of our experimental weaponry. And he gave me... Uh some sort of gift to give someone. Good for him. Uh, I have one from Orin Tai. My friends and I are working hard to expand our generous capacity for the Empire's needs. Your associates will be very impressed with what we can do, I assure you, and so far they've shown a lot more gratitude than those Republic cheesecakes. Thank you for giving us a chance. Glad I remember what that was all about. Okay. Um, we got another message from Vortox. Here's some more gear from my workshop, as well as a lightsaber from a Jedi target I recently had. But it's not important part of this message. I think, or know rather, that someone is trying to get you and your companions taken care of. I recently came across an anonymous bounty listing with both your names and your friend Eleanor's. I submitted a fake completion claim to buy you more time, but I'm going to find the source and take them out. I'll keep you updated. Watch your back. Holy cow, there's a lot of stuff here. Alright, um, I will take it. There's a lot of dyes. Hooray for dyes. Not sure what I'm going to do with all this. I'll figure it out. Alright. Put it in cold storage or something. Oh, and another die. Okay. Good. Mail done. Let's see if any of this stuff is stuff I can use. Nope. Why? Because I need to be level 43 before I can do any of this stuff. Okay, let's just put this all in storage. And then I'll go find Mouse. There we go. Okay. Now, she said she'd be in the cantina probably drunk off her rocker if I know her. Again, Jasa. Jasa. I do not want you to follow any of the traits she shows. Oh god, I can hear her. <sighs> Eleanor. <laughs> Eleanor. 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 Knock, nook, peek, lock, flock, flock, what the? Three, da, Eleanor? Pock, leak, knock, are you? Knock, pock, muck, nick, cock, dent, mud. Um, it says you're here, but you're not. Are you up somewhere? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You in a high place or something? No. What? Oh my gosh! What? Oh my gosh! What? What did. Is that a Shira? A Shira, a, a Shara? Shara, a Shara, whatever. What? What happened? What? We're clubbing. You're wearing a belly shirt, and she's not wearing anything. We're clubbing. We're clubbing like yeah. cool kids. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Clubbing okay. Like okay. Cool Jasa, kids. Jasa, cover them. La, la, la. Cover I'm them. I'm teaching my apprentice how You're... to party. Oh my gosh. She's a great student. I am so embarrassed. Can we can we get them back to the ship? Woo! Ha -ha! Woo! Oh no! Ah, that's great. Jason, do you you do you have like you you're a Jedi? Can you put them to sleep or something? What's wrong with you? Wait, what's up? Nothing other than you embarrassing me. I'm not embarrassing you. Apprentice. I'm having a fun time. You're just being a stupid old party. Oh <sighs> god, I'm a little drunk. Can we go now? Where are we going? We've got and missions to do. All right, let's do it. Not right now. Front. Put the lightsaber up. Um, hmm? Just follow me. Um, wait, 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 wait. What? And follow. Okay. Go. What the? All right. Whoa, 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 <laughs> whoa. <laughs> what, what, what? <laughs> Maybe I'm drunk too. 
Um, wait, you, you screwed up my pathing. Hang on. <laughs> God damn it. Uh oh, did I screw up your pathing? Yeah, you did. Oh no. Stop. Oh gee whiz. <laughs> Come on, the, Jason. I thought that said the booty hunter. <laughs> like, damn, yeah. Crap on it, get funky. Crap on it, get lucky. Uh, I don't know that woman. To Hoth! Yeah. See, Jason, she's so well behaved. You could learn a thing or two. Yeah, that's right. Jaysa, uh, you can learn a thing or three from me. No, what? No, she, you could. <sighs> Never mind. <laughs> and Ashara, you're a Jedi. You're supposed to be better than this. Hey, she was the one who picked out the outfit. I, I, I originally picked out the one that had like um a shirt. And the funny thing is, I think if it had been like anyone else, like if it had been Ven or something, parent would be fine with it. It's just that like Eleanor's his like sister. So, it's not, no, no, that's a no-go. It's nasty. Guys might start looking, and, uh, and then you have to cut them open with a lightsaber, and there's paperwork involved. Mm-hmm. 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 Yay, hooray for loading screens. Loading goo, loading goo, eh? Loading goo, loading go. goo, eh? To Hoth! Uh. Oh, hey, Quinn. Hi, Quinn! Oh, you look very different. You look like you are a man who's part of parents' team. It almost looks like someone was using you off camera, but not on camera. Huh. Yeah, no, funny no, how that, that works. No, that couldn't be the case. No. No. That's no. silly. To Hoth! To Hoth! Wait, 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 wait. I didn't, I didn't do it earlier. Spatar! There we yeah, go. Yeah, that, that ship is kind of already sailed. Spatar! We are, we're on a ship. Of course it's sailing, stupid. <laughs> Says the girl with a cold stomach. My stomach is plenty warm. Did you know that the stomach is the, the, the hottest part of the human body? Because it takes all the digestion. I'm making shit up. Don't listen to me, but you know. Okay. <laughs> I know that a large portion of your body's heat escapes through your head. And what am I wearing? A hood. So. Yep. Which Maybe. means you're just a big, fat, gassy head. You know, now that I'm taking a look at the planet we're landing on, I'm beginning to regret my <laughs> wardrobe choice. No, no, it's fine. Go ahead. Just uh, leave it on. It's gonna be cold. You should have thought about that before you went clubbing. We're <laughs> applying to get clubbing. Oh my god, Perrin's clubbing. like an old grandma. <laughs> well, you you put that about. clothes back on, you whipper snapper. Mm. Youth these days don't know what they're doing. Back in my day. Back, back when it meant something to go clubbing. <laughs> back in my day, only women I wanted to wear belly shirts wore belly shirts. <gasps> we called those women hussies. <laughs> I picture a parent as like a shaky old grandma. <laughs> Like just shaking all the time. You're not really sure if she's cold or it's just part of her character. <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong. I used to party with the best of them when I was younger. I still have my pasties that I wear from time to time when I'm feeling a bit frisky. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> There's so much wrong with what you just said. <laughs> Oh, shit. That's gross. That's nasty. It is really, That's really so gross. Nasty. Thank you for that image. It's I'm going to carry that in my heart forever. Staying down. <sighs> drooping all over the ground. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I, they won't go away. <laughs> go away, image. Go away. Leave me alone. I can't even drink something to get it to go away. 
Dun 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 dun. Da -da -da -da. Can't just land on the planet. No, that would make sense. Hi, bye. Wait, wait! What? You're going the wrong way. No, I'm going stupid. in circles. That's never the wrong way. You're being stupid. You're being stupid. You're stupid. Stupid. You're about to go down to an ice planet wearing a bathing suit. Don't call me God, I'm wearing pants, okay? At least give me that. You're wearing a two piece. What do you know? It, it could be uh, invisible armoring cloth. No. Over my tum tum. No, it's not. Holy fuck, it's cold. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, should we talk to this guy? Definitely not the place you want to wear pasties, I'll just say that. Or be an old lady wearing pasties. <laughs> We're up on the right. We're Let's talk to this guy. On the ground safe and sound, everyone. Clearance code says there is a Commander Triton in charge. My briefing said I was to meet a Colonel Vanus. Uh, I don't know anything about that. Commander Triton's the one listed as in charge now. I'm sure he can fill you in on the story. I need to de-ice the shuttle here. Okay. Well, Maybe fine. I can do that with how hot I am. Hey, 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 what are you looking at? Avert your eyes. <laughs> That's right, I'm a taken woman. But you can look if you want to. You can leave your friends behind, but if your taken friends Taken by can... spirits. What? 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 I'm what? calling you crazy! They call me crazy. Da, 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 da. Oh, is that Captain Trite, Crichton? Crichton yeah, from Red Dwarf? I'm not really sure. Talk to him. Boop. Your advice boils down to doing nothing, and that Back I can't Twilight in the do. background. Sir, <laughs> I respect your bravery, but if you see this through personally, you will be dead. And whose leadership will we have then? Mine! Hmm. Ah. We've been awaiting your arrival. This is Commander Triton, and I am known by the core name, Eudrus. Lieutenant Halpin sent word you would be coming, and we've never had greater need of you. Colonel Vanis, the commander of this base, is missing. We fear he's dead, along with all the most experienced men from this base. Fill me in on the situation. The colonel went out to investigate evidence of a possible spy probe near the ice lake. He was under heavy guard. We received a distress call. It was obvious he found trouble. Trouble, trouble. Scout one to dawn base. Heavy casualties. Taking heavy casualties. We're under attack. We can't see the. <laughs> Recordings don't frighten me. I'll go see if I can find out what happened. Our best case scenario is that Colonel Vanis's communications tipped off the Republic. And he's gone quiet. But if I were out in that cold, I'd have called for a rescue. If you can find a car, kind of everyone in this base is in your debt. <laughs> was he blocking him for you too? No. <laughs> it was like you could see his eyes, but Perrin's broad shoulders was covering everything else. <laughs> Perrin, Perrin, just a little to the right. What? 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 Yeah, a little. To, to the, what? To the, to the no. Girl Perrin. who wants a sweater said what? I am perfect. You know, part of being a Sith is to use the Force as a giant blanket. Board now. <laughs> let's go. All right, uh, where are we going? Oh, by the way, some, like, let's try. Hang on, class debriefing. I can't share this mission. No. Okay, never mind. We're up all night to get lucky. We're up all night to get lucky. I know that's not the words to the song, but I don't care because I'm up all night to get lucky. All right, long cold silence is where we're going. Um, so for which one are we doing? That. Planetary or? Yeah, let's do planetary first, shall we? Okay. Try and get us leveled up for the actual story. Or do you want to do story first and then planetary? It doesn't matter. I'm just trying to figure what's along the way. Well, how about we track them all and then we'll just go in the correct or the most convenient order. Yeah, works for me. Uh, let's right. see. Ah. Well, I uh... I will select my class. My, my class 
mission is uh, right closer than yours, and yours is right there too. So let's go do that first. Okay, wait, 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 wait. <sighs> All right. Okay. Ready? Mm, yep. Okay, let's go. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, do we go left? Do we go right? Okay then, I guess we're going left. <laughs> oh wait, no, I saw the green and I just assumed. We can go right. No, 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 we, we go, no we're going left. I want to go right. I want to go left. Well, then we are at a standoff. <laughs> da, 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 da. Okay, we'll go right. <laughs> we're just left. <laughs> 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 you know what? I'm not gonna question it. Man, do you guys get like any insulation other than with ice? Jesus! I think you were supposed to wear the insulation, silly. I'm looking for a ship called the Star Runner. My lord, yeah, truly yeah. an honor What's up? and a surprise. I'm afraid no ships have landed on Hoth in ages, unless it's a crash. Actually, the name Star Runner sounds familiar. If I may ask. What do you need the ship for? You're here on Darth Thanoson's behalf, naturally. I am my own master now. But you can be forgiven for thinking otherwise. Right, of course. I meant no offense, my lord. Star Is that Lord's on his back? Blast. Your ship crashed years ago. It's buried under a few tons of Tenor. snow by now. Your best bet? No. Give me a few months to get a recovery team on it. A Sith does what a Sith wants. Well, I mean, there's an Imperial Reclamation Service team you could take command of, if you wanted. It's just, the lieutenant in charge is a little odd. Too much time digging in tombs, you understand. I only care that he can find the ship. Lieutenant Talos Drellick could find a piece of glass in the Tatooine Desert, but he's very particular about his work. I'm afraid I can't call Lieutenant Drellick. The weather on Hoth is bad for communications. The team's way out in the way searching for some bitch. mythical Sith temple on Hoth of all places. Good luck, my lord. All right then. Reclamation teams. You know, I realize if I dance, I stay warm. I found like to get lucky. We're up on there to get lucky. We're not going to let him out to us. We're up on there to get lucky. 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 We're up all night to get lucky. I see Commander Lanklin. My lord, I am Ensign Slint, Commander Lanklin's second in command. You've arrived sooner than expected. The commander is in the field tracking Jedi Zerender, but has failed to report in. His tracer beacon hasn't moved for quite some time. Did he transmit any information for me? No, my lord. Transmissions on Hoth are sketchy and hard to make secure. This planet is a pitfall of hazards. There's a massive Republic presence, and all manner of power-hungry alien pirates. Our forces are stretched thin. A rescue party for Commander Lanklin would take several days to put together. <laughs> and on top of that, it's almost like the entire planet is ice. <laughs> I cannot afford delays. You and Lanklin... Oh, uh, no, 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 no. I, I meant this is a bad start for me, not... Ah, uh, silly game. I see Commander. I blame you. Commander. Yeah. Did he? Oh my lord, this planet. Our forces. I'll make sure Lanklin is brought to safety. There we go. I'm relieved, my lord. Here is the location indicated by the tracer beacon. It's in hostile territory. There are rumors of a heavily defended pirate stronghold in that sector. It will be hard to get in. Consider me warned. I hope you are successful, my lord. The pirates hate the Empire. If Commander Lanklin has fallen into their clutches, I hate to think what's happened. Whoa. Hmm? Oh, there's a lot of stuff here. I gotta choose. I guess because I have more companions, so now I have more... Oh, uh, more options? Yeah, I'm just taking the, that. Alright. Let's go, let's go, let's do stuff. Yeah! Yeah, let's go do stuff. We got stuff to do. We totally got stuff to do. See. You're, not using, you're not using X boost, are you? Oh, shit. How'd you know? 
Because I can see when you're using an X boost. I mean, yes, I am. I can see everything. Stop seeing things. No. Okay, Get the maybe goddamn a little. phone book. <laughs> Get the book. Get the book. What? Get the book. Where uh, are you going? I, I don't know. I'm following you. Your your following was misplaced. We gotta wait for the elevator. Oh no, someone has a, a, a Twilight running around in underwear. Yeah, I noticed that. I was like, my goodness. Well, we're about to oh get Oh my god! Ah! 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 Oh. oh, we're fine. Okay, oh. that's cool. Alright. Wait! Where's Floatsome? Oh, there you are. It's right there. Okay. Hi. I'm just getting lucky. We're bumping to get lucky. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He's a demon on wheels. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da speed racer. <laughs> I sense a lot of apathy and disgruntlement. The morale of Imperial forces here is as low as the temperature. That's deep. Wow. You are <laughs> cheerful, aren't you? Pretty... <laughs> oh, Jason, do you feel that? That brisk wind? Yep. Feels great, actually. Man, I've never felt more alive. Oh, by the way, we have this cold weather equipment mm -hmm. that is going to make me even warmer now. Yep. Yep. It's a good feeling. Is that what it does? Like, I, don't know. I guess. You know, we're both out in this direction, basically. Uh, oh, except for you, the long cold silence. We got to go to those coordinates. So let's do it. Long cord. Ah. Oh. Wait, let me get on my boat. Okay. Let's do this. Let's go time. I was born for this. Really? I sense a lot of apathy and disgruntlement. <laughs> the morale of the Imperial forces here is as low as the temperature. You're just repeating what Jace has said. I'm not. I made that up myself. I thought it was poetic. <laughs> no, you didn't. <laughs> you were born for. The, you were born to to ride across a frozen tundra. I was. Such low aspirations. Listen, don't you dare judge my aspirations. Oh, hey, it's Pride Rock. Uh, it's hey, hey, uh, da, 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 da. Oh god, no! Oh, uh, Simba! Simba! You I killed Mufasa! No! 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 Yay, birthday! <laughs> I don't know, Schwarzenegger killed Mufasa? What are we doing here? We're going here. Okay. Speak to Talos Dralik. Mounts are not allowed in here. Hope I ha! Can help. My mount lasted longer than your mount did. Uh, no? Yep. Yep. I got visual proof. Well, can you do this? No. There we go. Speed's not everything. Oh, trust me. It is. No, it's it not. It is. Later, shitlord! What? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Up all night to get lucky. Really need to heal though. <laughs> You're lucky. We're up all night to get lucky. Hello. Oh. Hello, people. Hi guys. What's up? What are we doing? Okay, you're not important. We're just gonna ignore you. Later. I'm kill this man. You. What the hell is that? That's a thing. I suggest we kill it. it smells bad. Yeah, a little bit. Oh, it smells like right. space oh. Cheetos. And I have to get reused to healing you. Ooh, we have a bonus here. A bonus? A bonus kill one out of twenty. Oh, okay, okay, good, good, good. So I will keep a track on your health as well as the health of our teammates. Right, Ooh. we no longer have oh. double healing going on. That's right. That you guys didn't get to see. But we did! <laughs> Ouchie! It's weird, I can't see Jace on my um, mini thing. Oh, that's a shame. Yeah. Not so good for- oh no, no, she's back. That was weird. No, apprentice. With the force you cannot do everything. 
First lesson, the force is a lie. It's not real. It's all in your head. Just like M. Night Shyamalan. Let's go. M. Night Shyamalan's all in my head? Yep, you have a really fucked up imagination, my friend. I'm so sorry to everyone. What have you done? Oh my god, Why airbenders all my fault. Why would an alien species that is allergic to water go to a planet which is predominantly made of I'm water? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Why? Why, why would I dream of a man who would slaughter the airbender? <laughs> look at it! You look at it! I look at it! We all are made of ice cream! <laughs> what? I don't know. I don't know. What a twist! What a twist! <laughs> Yay, we're killing the indigenous population. Right, that's my favorite pastime. Did you know that? I did know that. Mm. So you also know it's my birthday. Jason, write that down. What? Yeah, of course. It's not your birthday. You didn't get me a present, did you? It's, no, because it's not your birthday. It is my birthday. It's not your birthday. <gasps> How could you forget? Because you said that last week, and the month before, and the month before that. Well... In fact, wait. you keep trying to say every month is your birthday. Wait, wait. How did you figure out that birthdays only come once a year? Who told you? <sighs> Jaysa? Wait, where is she? <laughs> like, like, parents like, wait, what? <laughs> birthdays only come once a year? <laughs> no! <laughs> it's like, yes, master, only once a year. Mouse! <laughs> <laughs> The shenanigans we get into. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, shit. Mouse, you got some splaining to do. Oh, mouse. Zip boom, straight to the moon. <laughs> Wilbur. <laughs> <laughs> I would make the sound effect to twitch my nose if I could. <laughs> Noise that always happened, right? Is like yeah, it was like a little. It's like a little bell twinkling. Yeah. And I tell you, worst mother-in-law ever. Oh yeah, hands down, she was the nightmare. Poor Darren. Oh Darren, he's been through a lot over the years. And if none of you know what we're talking about, you need to get older. Yeah, like super older. Watch Nick. Actually, I don't think it's even. I think it's too old for Nick at Night now. Yeah, I don't think you... You gotta watch, like, your local, like, classic television station and watch all the good old shit. Yeah. That shit's the best shit. It is. It is really entertaining, actually. It is? Yeah. Like I think F we had a conversation about Dick Van Dyke before. Yeah, we like, did. Like, one of the last episodes. F Troop. MASH. MASH is a little bit later. Happy Days. Yeah. Oh, Happy Days. Happy Days is a good one. Yeah, but not that spinoff. Not the... Whatever her name is, Chachi. Oh, yeah, no, that, no. That was a no go. Yeah, Lucy. Laverne and Shirley. Mr. Ed. Mary Tyler Moore show. Mary Tyler Moore. Ah, beautiful lady. Beautiful lady. We should actually be adding space in front of all those. Space Dick Van Dyke. Oh, yeah. <laughs> to make it. Space Mary Tyler Moore. <laughs> I'm, like, picturing, like, now all, like, the openings with. You know, space involved, so Dick Van Dyke is just tripping over stuff in space, so he's like floating <laughs> out into the <laughs> just to the dark void that is space. Oh, like, oh Dick. Oh, wasn't a bad job, didn't he? Wasn't he just like a joke writer? He just sat there all day and wrote jokes. Yeah. No, it was it was it a joke writer or was it like for um no, maybe you're right. I thought it was it was more like geared for like, mm, maybe not. It's been a while since maybe I watched for a show. Maybe for like a particular show, but still, man, back in the day when everyone had exotic jobs, you know, sitcoms today they're like delivery men and accountants yeah. and stuff. But they used to be, you know, Ricky was like the nightclub owner. Dick mm -hmm. Van Dyke was like a joke writer. Mm -hmm. 
I don't remember what Darren did, but his wife was a witch, so that counts. Wasn't Darren in the military? No, no, no. No, 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 no that I'm was Idrie of... Magini. Yeah, he was a colonel in the Air Force. I was thinking of, uh... Idrie Magini. Yeah, that, 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 yeah. that guy. I don't remember what, what Darren was. What was his was. name? Oh, man, I don't remember. He, they just called him Colonel or something. Hmm. Colonel... Hello, my master. Hello, Genie. my master. Hello, you, my master. You know, you know he totally wished for her to, to like, sleep with him. Oh, yeah, because no one else would. He's kind of a loser if you didn't, you know. <laughs> oh, wow. Master, you're kind of a If it wasn't for me. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm the sexiest thing since sex. Whee! I invented sex. I, I love, um, I watch, like, uh, like a documentary on I Dream of Genie, and they had, like, this whole debacle that they had to make sure her belly button didn't show. What? Yeah, so they always kept her, like, the the camera. TV rating guys. Yeah. Uh. Well, they either kept the, uh, the camera, you know, above a certain point, or they had her, um, her, like, sash around her waist higher up so her belly button wouldn't show. And there was this one time when she kind of, like, maneuvered and her belly pu button poked out for a moment, and people just flipped the fuck out, like, oh my god. Wow. wow. Belly buttons! Imagine what belly. would happen if, uh, if, uh, if... Janet Jackson had a wardrobe malfunction back then. Oh God! The world so, would have ended. I was gonna say it would have exploded. Like, yikes! But hey, with that happy note, let's end this episode. Oh Woo! yeah, what a weird discussion that was. Bye everyone. Bye. <laughs>